ne. Or should I say, ha, ha, ha. I'm back with another review, Christmas themed. That's right, as you may have gathered from the intro and my attire, there are certain animated specials that are that are a must this time of year. Whether it's Charlie Brown or Frosty or Rudolph, but for me, it has to be the ultimate Christmas classic. From the youth, that's right, He-Man and She-Ra's A Christmas Special. Oh yeah! Peace and love and caring, peace on earth. But we'll get to that in a little bit. But yes, I am here as I have the DVD of He-Man and she -Ra, A Christmas Special. This is hard to come by. I am thankful I picked this little bad boy up when it came out into the stores, I think, 10 years ago. It was released first in 2005 and then sold to somebody else, and they re-released it in 2010. And so I'm going to do the review, and then I'll do the DVD review, and we'll get to that. But yes, this is the Christmas classic starring He-Man and She-Ra, along with Skeletor and Hordak. Orca plays a major role, and it's essentially the uh, you know Orca ends up on a space on a new craft, ends up on Earth, and finds these two lost kids who are out shopping for a Christmas tree without their parents. Don't even get me started on that. And then they are luckily rescued by Man at Arms, home back to Eternia. And then the evil Lord Prime senses the the purity of the Chris of the Christmas spirit, of the love and caring that they're bringing to 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 the planets. So then, their Hordak and Skeletor are set out on a mission to to basically get rid of them. He and Shira have to save them. And ironically, spoiler alert: if you haven't seen this in thirty years. Skeletor is the one to save the day. That's right. The big bad of the He-Man mythology saves the day because of the Christmas spirit. And as He-Man points out, it only comes once a year, so Skeletor doesn't have to worry. But it's just that powerful of a special that Hordak is overcome by Skeletor's Christmas so yes, it's a forty. It's about a fifty minute. It's actually forty five minutes. Um, it is on DVD, but I guess if you don't have it, if you haven't found it, if you don't have it from VHS from years ago, YouTube has it. I've looked. That's actually how I queued up the video. Um, you know, you just have to watch through a couple ads, but He Man official channel on YouTube has it in its entirety, along with. Tons of other He-Man stuff, so I recommend using YouTube to enjoy this Christmas classic. Um, and do you know when this came out? I'll tell you, because I can't. I remember watching it as a kid, and then watching as I get older. Of course, now I feel differently about it, even though I still love the Christmas spirit within. This came out Christmas Day. 1985. My wife was eight months old. Not even going to start on the math. I was like 33. But yes, I remember watching this as a kid and I was so happy when it came back out. Um, and if you're a fan, one of the, my favorite things to do when you watch the beginning and the end of the special is pretty much cameo by every toy 
character that was featured on either show is on this special. Um, it's a Christmas special because they're celebrating the the birth of 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 the twins, and it's right before Christmas, and it ends up being a big Christmas special for the for the kids that stowed away from Earth as a birthday celebration slash Christmas party. Um, which is actually funny since the queen is from Earth and has never mentioned or brought Christmas up before. Heck, I would carry that over to wherever I landed. But, um, so yeah, so that's, it's just cool, especially for someone who had a garbage bag full of the toys and uh, collectibles. Um, just to watch, now I don't, I can't remember any, most of their names, but just to see them and remember them was pretty cool. Um, it's 45 minutes, so it's basically two episodes, and I will segue that into three things that I love, 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 and three things that I'm like, eh, not so much. So, three things that I love, Team Anashira, love it, I love it, not, of course, Secret, uh, Secret of the Sword is my favorite, but this is a great special to have, which came out. He-Man was already done. This came out in between, basically during the She-Ra's run, which She-Ra ran until December of 86. So this came out a year prior, um, which growing up, I always thought this came out after. So I was actually, um, it's kind of cool to, that you still got He-Man for like another year, I guess, starting on She-Ra's show. Um, but I just couldn't get enough of He-Man. Um... I love the Christmas, you know, it's funny, you know, the spirit of Christmas, which they talk about, Beth, the kids talk about Bethlehem and all that, and just the spirit of Christmas caught up, um, and how it overcomes is very, you know, because I still believe in the magic of Christmas, and to see it, Skeletor overcome by it to save the day is just another thing that I love, and then the third thing that I love as I mentioned before, it was all the cameos of the characters and just everybody on both planets coming together to celebrate this this momentous day of Christmas and then, of course, the birth of the twins, uh, He-Man and she and Adam and Adora. Um, but, yeah, I just I can't get enough of this Christmas special. Um, so I'm very, like I said, I'm. if you want to add a fourth thing, this DVD which uh, has special features, um, the holidays and morals of the He-Man and the Masters of the Universe. Um, adds about, combined runtime about 68 minutes, so that gives you another hour of goodies. Two collectible cards. I have the Power Music video featurette, which is another 10 minutes. And then just character profiles, trivia, fun facts. And then if you have a PC, um, you can download the script for the Christmas special just as a collectible. So love that. Um, I would love if they would finally release this on Blu-ray. They just did it with Batman the Animated Series. Now I need it with Thundercats and He-Man. And I'll be set. And, of course, Turtles. Um, so three things that, eh, not so much. My number one cripe was no Battle Cat. How can you have a Christmas special? You got Swift Wind, her pet, slash flying animal, and there's no Battle Cat to help He-Man. I know there wasn't much for him to do, but just have Battle Cat show up and just to know Batman, I mean, what is Christmas? So, yeah, that was my biggest thing that I noticed. Um, second thing, not so much, which, granted, this is aimed at kids, so this is me nitpicking, but the kids were out buying their own Christmas tree or chopping down their own Christmas tree while the parents were chilling in their nice and warm house. Didn't know where the kids were for like a day or two. And then they show up at the very, oh, how's everything going? And the kids fly by. Now, again, I am, this is aimed for He-Man, but I'm just like, them parents have got to go. Sure, sending your old kid out in the cold, ending up on a distant planet, which if not for that, then Skeletor wouldn't have been redeemed for a day, for a year. But that was like, eh, that, that was too much for me. And then third, not long enough. 
Secret of the Sword went a uh, combined five ep or was it five episodes? Three, some like, three to five episodes. I forget. It's been a while. I think it's three episodes. No, it is the first five episodes. I'm sorry. This hush. Um, first five episodes. This would only compile two, and that's just the fanboy and me wanting more of it. Uh, they stretch it out for what it was already by adding the new machine characters and Horde Prime at the very end rushed that felt rushed at the end. But to I still enjoy I those are just me finding three things. My biggest thing was Battle Cat and the Parents, but uh I get for for movie theater, I I give it five out of five seats just be or well, I'm sorry. It's not five out of of course there's room for improvement. But we'll definitely fill four and a half out of five seats. So definitely YouTube this if you don't have the DVD like I do. It's so pretty though. You can make sure you find it on eBay or something. It's worth it. I promise. Hopefully stores will really release it. Like I said, it's been since 2010. It's probably when I picked this up. Um, but yes, I'm just letting you take in the beautiful art of this Christmas special. So... Until next time, this is me. If you like this video with this movie review, I hope you did. Mark, you know, I appreciate you checking in to see Mark's just reviewing. Uh, he and I at Christmas. Make sure you like, uh, subscribe, send me some money if you want me to buy some movies and stuff to review for you. Because I will for you, the people. Um, and until next time. I hope, hope, hope you stay frosty. Peace! The Santa, that's wonderful. We've got just the right setting for my new Christmas song. Let's try it. I'll be carrying peace on this. Oh, yeah, yeah. Beautiful. <laughs>